Hello, my name is Dr. Diwan S. Raja. Today I will discuss about the anatomy of the sural nerve. The sural nerve is a branch of the tibial nerve. So, the sural nerve is a branch of the tibial nerve in the popliteal fossa. Okay. The sural nerve is a branch of the tibial nerve. This is the tibial nerve. This is the tibial nerve and this area, diamond shape area is the popliteal fossa. So we get a branch from the tibial nerve that is the sural nerve. The sural nerve has root values are the L5, S1, and S2. Okay, root value L5, S1, and S2. The sural nerve passes between the two head of the gastric nemias. The sural nerve. passes between the two heads of the gastrocnemius muscle gastrocnemius and pyrosis the deep fascia the fascia just above the at the or just above the middle of the middle of the back of the leg back of the leg okay so to the side it becomes cutaneous. So here is side it becomes cutaneous. Here it is a cutaneous nerve formed here then it pierces the pierces the deep fascia here and it is it becomes cutaneous here and the sural nerve is accompanied by the small saphenous vein. The sural nerve is accompanied by is accompanied by the small saphenous vein. Okay, so this is the small saphenous vein. This is the small saphenous vein. Okay, then the sural nerve passes behind the lateral malleolus. This is the lateral malleolus, malleolus of the fibula. So, the sural nerve passes behind and inferior to the lateral malleolus 
malleolus and then passes along the along the lateral border of the foot foot up to the to the little toe little toe okay so we call it the the sural nerve it is a branch of the tibial nerve it becomes cutaneous here it pierces the deep fascia it is cutaneous it pierces the deep fascia here and it accompanied by the small saphenous vein passes behind the posterior part of the lateral malleolus and inferior to the lateral malleolus then it goes to the little toe okay little toe and it it has area of distribution sural nerve so area from where it pick up sensation okay so area of distribution is the posterior part of the lower half of the leg so area of sensory function this is a sensory nerve sensory function the sural nerve is a sensory nerve this is a purely sensory nerve so it pick up sensation from the lower half of the of the back of the leg okay then from the lateral aspect of the lateral aspect of the of the ankle joint okay and lateral border border and and the lateral part of the dorsum of the foot lateral part of the dorsum dorsum of the foot of the foot okay so it is here this is that this is the this is the area of distribution it pick up sensation like pain touch temperature we got from the lower half of the back of the leg from the lateral aspect of the ankle joint lateral border and lateral part of the dorsum of the foot okay so we got the area of sensory function it is a purely sensory nerve okay it also innervates the ankle joint it also innervates not only skin it also innervates the ankle joint okay it inner red in addition to the skin it it innervates the ankle joint the ankle joint in addition to the to the skin skin means the lower half of the middle of the leg the lateral aspect of the ankle joint lateral part of the dorsum of the foot plus lateral margin of the foot here up to the little toe okay we got the sensory area of distribution by the sural nerve okay sural nerve it gets communication the sural nerve is 
communicated, communicated by the sural communicating nerve. Sural communicating nerve. And that sural communicating nerve is this. That is the sural communicating nerve. Communicating nerve. And that sural communicating nerve is a branch of the common fibular nerve. That is the branch of the common fibular or common peroneal nerve. Common fibular nerve. Okay. This is tibial nerve common fibular nerve, this is the sciatic nerve, this is the sciatic nerve, sciatic nerve, okay, we got the sural nerve, it's communicating, it gets communicating branch from the sural communicating nerve, that is a branch of the common fibular nerve and that communication is communicating near the heel, okay, near the lateral malleolus, maybe even in the popliteal region. So, where it will communicate is a little bit variable, we got that. So, some books say the sural nerve begins here, this is the sural nerve, this is the medial sural cutaneous nerve, this is the sural communicating nerve, this is the sural nerve, but according to the gray, we think the Sural nerve is a branch of tibial nerve. Okay, we'll now learn some clinical anatomy. Okay, sural nerve is a purely sensory nerve. So the sural nerve can be used for nerve grafting. Okay, sural nerve. can be used for nerve grafting. Okay, we got the sural nerve is clinical importance. And that's all about the sural nerve. If you like my video, please support my channel. Please subscribe me and share the information with your friend friends have a nice day bye now